all new this morning. Nearly one in 54 children are on the autism spectrum. That's according to the CDC. The disorder can substantially limit a person's independence, but a local organization is making a mark by building a more inclusive community. Awareness, advocacy, and assuring quality of life. We're really there to be the travel guide, so to speak, through all the resources because that is very daunting. Nicole Miller is Chapter Operations Manager of the Autism Society Tidewater, Virginia. The nonprofit supports people and families impacted by autism. For 40 years, uh, we have created a community of inclusivity where everyone is welcome, whether you're a parent, caregiver, an individual on the spectrum, and you can come and find individuals of uh, like-mindedness. The organization is helping with medical payments and awarding scholarships after taking a financial hit during the pandemic. But yeah, so we got none of the stimulus funds or anything, zero dollars, 100 percent. We didn't take out any loans. Some major support came in the form of fundraisers like Macy's Ride for Autism, where bikers raised about seven thousand dollars last year. Tom Gorney holds the event in honor of his granddaughter. Uh, seven years ago, Macy had just been diagnosed with autism as being on the spectrum. We decided the motorcycle community likes to have a reason to raise money and have fun. So we combined the two and this is what we ended up with. As a sense of normalcy returns, the Autism Society is looking ahead, finding more ways to promote acceptance and inclusivity. Increasing the number of hours and, and direct engagement with individuals on the autism spectrum is what is needed. There's an actual person behind that diagnosis and that person deserves your love and respect just like they would give to you. The group is co-hosting a family fun day Saturday afternoon in Virginia Beach and then the next Macy's Ride fundraiser is Sunday morning. For more information, check out the links in this story on our website after daybreak. And don't forget to reach out if you or someone you know is making a mark. Send me an email or reach out on social media.